Hello guys and welcome back, it's Crafty Fox, and today we're going to be building Oliver the Great Western Engine. Now he was the engine that was saved from scrap by Douglas, and he had a brake van named Toad. And this is the all new 2020 design, just a couple of days till 2021 though. And here is the older design of Oliver, which ironically he is going to get scrapped after I film this video. Uh, but we do like the new version a lot better. Has a lot of the end rod detailing, which I did not actually add in the original one. And um, yeah, I am also working on a uh, duck in the background. So you guys got like the two great western, little west, I think they call it the little western railway. Uh, but yeah, I hope you guys enjoy this video. And let's begin. So first off, let's grab some materials. A red concrete, black concrete, green concrete, prism rain brick stairs, a red sandstone wall, acacia slab, dark oak trap door, a lever, another brick fence. So we're gonna go on top of the tracks and we're gonna make it three blocks tall, red concrete, delete the bottom two, and then we're gonna make the top part five blocks wide. So then we'll add black concrete right behind the middle, 17 blocks long, so 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. And we're going to make it 5 blocks wide of red concrete in the back. And then we'll add a row of 5 black concretes behind it. Same thing in the front, just a row of black concrete. And then the front edge, we'll add in a lever in the middle, pull that down. Uh, another brick fence next to it and underneath it. And I'm going to make this one two blocks tall. Add red sandstone walls on the edges. We have a dark oak trapdoor, I'm going to close that up. Then on top, we're going to add in four acacia slabs on the right hand side. And we'll go to the back. Add in a row of five acacia slabs on top. A lever in the middle, pull that down, another brick fence underneath, and another brick fence diagonally up. Uh, red sandstone walls on the edges, dark oak trap doors, close them up in front of the walls. So next we'll take out lime concrete, we're going to add 5 blocks wide. And we're going to make this segment, so it's 4 blocks tall, so 1, 2, 3, 4, other side, same thing. And then we're going to add in a row 5 on the top row. If upside down, uh, prismarine brick stairs underneath. And fill in the inside with lime concrete. Go to this outer edge here again. And we're going to add another 4 blocks tall lime concrete. Then 2 blocks tall. And then 3 blocks tall. Alright, and then we'll do the same thing on the other side. Just copy what we did. Then we'll add in four blocks tall lime concrete here. Other side, same thing. And then there's gonna actually be five blocks tall like that. Then we'll take a uh, prismarine brick slab, we're gonna add in two right here, and then one at the bottom. Other side, same thing. Two at the top, one at the bottom for the window. And then we'll take out uh, this black glass block. And we'll add that right here to the back. With a warped trap door right behind it, we're going to close that up. I'm going to add black stained glass block in the front of the caps. And lime concrete in the middle. I'm going to add a row of five lime concretes. And then we're going to make a three by three of lime concrete in the front of that. Then we're going to add in six lime concretes in the middle. So one, two, three, four, five, six. And skip two, add one here to the side. The side, same thing. And we'll add prismarine brick slab on top, three blocks wide. Skip a block, lime concrete, and prismarine brick slab on top. And then we'll add prismarine brick stairs along the top edges, both sides. 
And underneath that, we're going to add in three lime concretes. And then three prismarine bricks uh, stairs underneath that. Other side, same thing. And next in the front of that, we'll add in um, two black concretes. We're going to make it plus sign with it. And then we'll add in another two on top. Then we'll take nether brick stairs to fill in the corners of this. The other side, same thing. And the bottom row, there's going to be two um, these back to back nether brick stairs at the bottom. In the middle, it's going to be black concrete. So just fill that in. And then we'll need to make his face, so smooth quartz stairs and a block, make a plus sign, add in stairs in the corners. His face pretty much comes pretty close to the edge. And then up here, we'll add in this chain block. He has a little antenna. I don't think many people really notice that this exists, because I didn't. <laughs> and then we'll add in a diorite wall on the left hand side. Okay. Then we're going to add in a lime concrete, um, go on this outer edge, like this, to make it three blocks tall. And then we're going to extend the bottom row across. I'm going to extend the top row across. Other side, we'll do the same thing. Lime concrete here, three blocks tall. And we're going to make the top row and the bottom row go all the way across. Then we'll take out a gold block and a yellow wool. Add a gold block right in this nook. Then we're going to skip three blocks, add a yellow wool. Other side, we'll do the same thing. Skip three, yellow wool, and then lime concrete for the rest. All right. Then on the roof, we'll take out another brick slab. And we're going to add in a row of three in the middle. And this is going to go all the way to the back of the cab. There. Okay, so then we'll add in a black carpet along the sides of the roof of the cab. Like so. And then we'll take out a lime banner and we're going to add that to the sides of these windows. Where we have the glass. So, and in the back, there's going to be a block of coal, three blocks wide, in the coal bunker, and fill in this wall in with lime concrete, like so. Then we'll go and add in uh, this lime glass pane on either side of the middle here. Another one to the side of this tank, other side, same thing. And then in the back, we're going to add in one in the middle, another one down here, and on the sides. Then we're going to take out uh, this iron bar and we're going to make a column of three blocks tall iron bars next to this doorway. Other side we'll do the same thing. And then we'll make this middle part. It's an oak fence with an oak stairs in the front of that. And then there will be um, three lime concretes underneath these stairs, so one, two, three, and then add one sticking out here and fill in this part with the stairs. Other side will do the same thing, so three of the lime concretes and one sticking out and fill in the inside. Then we'll take out smooth stone slab and we'll add that in the front and the back of this and a prismarine brick stairs next to the lime concrete either side. We'll do the same thing over here. That. And then we'll take out uh, end rods. And we'll add one in the middle, three blocks wide. And we're going to add another two over here. Go diagonally up. And this is going to extend all the way to that uh, nether brick. Other side, we'll do the same thing.
And in the back where the cab is, um, there's going to be another two here. And then uh, another two in the front of that. Other side of the cab, we'll do the same thing. And then yet another two. And make sure they're going in the right direction. It's like close to the edge. And in the back there is going to be one. Like that. Both sides. Like so. Alrighty. And now we'll add in this warped button. This little corner of the tanks. Alright, then we're going to go on the inside of the cab. And uh, it's going to be a bit difficult to place, so I'm going to have to temporarily remove that slab. So we'll replace these middle three with a light gray concrete. And uh, this is going to be four blocks tall. Like that, and then we'll get outside the cab. Put that slab back. Now we're going to add in the wheels, so let's take out uh, lime concrete. And we're going to make a plus sign right here, so right adjacent to this um, half semicircle, we're going to make the wheel here. So make it like this. And then we'll skip a block and we'll add in another one. Add in prismarine brick stairs in the corners. And then we'll do the same thing on the other side. Another one right over here. And prismarine brick stairs in the corners. Okay, so then we're gonna count one, two, three, four blocks. So two, four, and then we're gonna make a two by two wheel in the back of dark or just prismarine brick stairs. And then we'll add in um, two back to back, another brick stairs on the edge here. Sides like that. And then we'll add in another brick slab and then two blocks tall, another brick stairs. So another brick slab here, then two blocks tall, another brick stairs. Like that. Do the same thing on the other side. So another brick slab. And then the nether brick stairs. Like that. And after that, there will be a two upside down nether brick stairs. One, two. And it looks to be another nether brick stairs in the front of the second wheel. So right there. And one right side up underneath that. And the rest is going to be slabs across the top. All the way across. We'll do the same thing in the other side. Slabs all the way across. Okay, so then we're going to add in the coupling rods. So that's going to be stone brick stairs in the middle of these wheels. And then two stonework slabs, the top part. On the side, we'll do the same thing. Stonework stairs. And slabs in between. All right. And then the middle of this, we'll add in a black concrete block in the middle of the wheel. And uh, this is going to extend to the back of the second pair of driving wheels. Like that. And then we're going to fill in this uh, whole area right above. And we're going to fill in this gap all the way across here, whatever area you can fill in. 
fill that in. Okay, and then we're gonna extend this middle black concrete all the way to the back wheel. And we're gonna make it go past it by one, add it upside down near the brick stairs behind it. And then we'll take out another brick slab. We're gonna add that in the middle of the front wheel. And we're gonna try to add it in between these two driving wheels as well. And add in another one in the middle of this. Then we'll add in, so it goes one block away from the back wheel. That. Then we'll go to the front, add in a dark oak sign in the middle. Like that. Then we'll take out another brick wall. And we're going to add in uh, two blocks in the front. And then another brick slab in the back. Other side, we'll do the same thing. Two nether brick walls and then a slab on the other side, like so. Alright, so once you finish that, that is pretty much it on how to build Oliver from Tom's Friends in Minecraft. I hope you guys enjoy this video. If you do, remember to hit that like button down below. Subscribe if you had already, and I will see you guys in the next one.